Hello and welcome to the Disabled People's Project, which showcases biographies of people with disabilities doing great things in life. Each episode or post is a different biography lasting less than three minutes. You can see my projects on other platforms in the comments section. Today's biography is Josiah Wedgwood. Josiah was the founder of Wedgwood Factory, which still to this day makes a range of pottery from vases to tea sets, for example. Josiah was an entrepreneur and made significant contributions to European pottery. Wedgwood never made porcelain, but specialised in stoneware and other materials, which was significantly cheaper and brought much more versatility. Josiah invented the Jasper ware. His designs were in demand by royalty and the upper class. Often it was given as presents and collections which are within the British Museum. Josiah Wedgwood contracted smallpox as a child which led to his right knee having, to, having a significant disability. Josiah later had added leg amputated in his 30s. Josiah disguised the amputation by covering his leg, rarely talked about it and did not want it on any painting. As with my other biography on Samuel Johnson, who was from that era and was from a similar uh, circle called the Enlightenment Philosophers, also hid his disability, as it was viewed as negative by society. Josiah was good friends with Erasmus Darwin and the Enlightenment Philosophers Circle and later became grandfather to Charles Darwin through marriage and Charles Darwin and later married into the Wedgwood factory too. Josiah and other Enlightenment philosophers also highlighted, such as the Samuel Johnson biography, campaigned against slavery and was prominent in abolishing slavery in the UK. When Josiah contracted smallpox as a child, it gave him time to think creatively, which helped him develop his thoughts for positive society developments. Disability in his knee and later amputation in his 30 meant he could not operate pottery machinery. This is thought to have helped him revolutionise the pottery industry. Josiah developed the pottery industry through systematic experimentation. Josiah revolutionised pottery through innovative methodology and been interested in other disciplines such as chemistry design and philanthropy. Also, this was a period of innovation, which was the start of the Industrial Revolution, with friends such as Erasmus Darwin and the Enlightenment philosophers been at the forefront in making considerable contributions to its success. Maybe without Josiah's smallpox as a child and later disability, Josiah may not have been, had this leap into entrepreneurship and may uh, have operated the pottery machine instead. The written version of this biography can be found on my Facebook platform in the comments section with photo credits, more information about issues discussed uh, and more information about Josiah, Wedgwood Factory and smallpox. Thanks for listening. Like and follow if you want more.